Hello, this is Eric with Sleal Tech, and today I've got a tips and tricks video on Power Automate. If you find yourself creating the same tasks over and over, I've got a solution for you. I'm going to show you how you can automate task creation using Power Automate. Before we begin, we need to identify where your task list is saved. We need to identify the site name and the list name. You can identify the site name by checking here. Or if you go to home, you can also see the top of the page, right here. You can find the name of your task list by checking at the very top, right here. Okay, so I'm going to write those down so I don't forget. All right, now we're ready to jump into Power Automate. To jump into Power Automate, we click on the Waffle Menu button and click Power Automate. From here, in the left navigation bar, we can click My Flows. We can click on New, Scheduled, and we can give our flow a name. I'm going to call mine task automation. From here we choose which day do you want your flow to start running. Today is a Friday and I want my flow to start running on May 4th. So on Monday. You choose at what time of the day do you want it to run. Uh, for me, I want my tasks to be created right in the early morning. So when everybody comes in, they can have their tasks created in the morning and here's where you choose the occurrence how often do you want these tasks to be created you can choose from daily to weekly month or every hour every minute or every second I really like the week option just because it gives you the option to pick which days of the week do you want this flow to run as of now we have all the days of the week selected meaning that the flow will run every day. You can uncheck these as you see necessary. So for example, if you want this to run every working day, you can unselect Sunday and unselect Saturday. And here it will tell you which days of the week the flow will run. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. In my case, I only want them to run once a week, and that'll be every Monday. So I can uncheck all the other days. And here we can confirm that my flow will only run on Mondays. Okay, great. So now we have my flow program to run on May 4th, 6 a.m. and only on Mondays. Great. Let's click create. From here we click on new step. And we want to look for the action called create item. Okay, here we're going to pick our site address. Since we wrote it down, we know exactly what it is. Mine's called onboarding. And here it is. Just click on it. List name. Now, task lists aren't usually one of the options, so we can enter custom value. And there you go. Here, you can start filling out everything needed to create a task. So, task name. In the assign to field, you can either choose one of the suggested groups or type in a person's email. To do that, you type in enter custom value and you type the email of the person you want to assign this task to. For our start date, you want to create an expression because our start date will be whenever this flow runs. So every Monday at 6 a.m. To do that, you can use the expression UTC now. This expression will calculate whatever time it is 
when this flow runs. Now for my due date, I want to make it due every Friday. And for that, we're going to need to use two expressions. So we're going to start with an add days expression. And inside the add days expression, we want to add the UTC now expression. Since we know that UTC now is going to be every Monday, we need to add four days to make our due date every Friday. So to do this, you just put comma and the number of days you want to add. Mine's four. Press OK. And now we can type in anything else we need to create our task. Our task status will be not started by default. Our priority is going to be normal. And you can type in the description right here. Your list will be a little different from mine, but you can fill yours accordingly. Just make sure to click save. All right, and that's it. We've created an automated task creation system. And your flow is ready to run. Thank you very much.